This is the part that gives me the most anxiety. Okay. So we have all of this luggage here. This is my luggage. And right before a trip, I get so anxious. My anxiety is like an all time high. I just constantly am thinking about what I brought. Did I bring too much? Did I not bring enough? Did I forget things? I have a big check bag here. Right before I zip everything up, I like throw a bunch more things on and I'm like, I need these things. We're not leaving super, super early today, which is nice. I went out and I got Starbucks and Peter's making us some food and I'm gonna just basically go through what I have in here one more time because I have the time. So this is some things that I just slapped on top. So this is kind of how it sits as it currently is, just some things wrapped up. And then a ton of shoes over here. I'm probably bringing like one, two, three, four, eight shoes for three days. You never know. All right, the food's ready. I'm gonna go eat that really quick and then I'm gonna finish. quick comment and then I I've never used packing cubes ever before and I just redid his luggage using the packing packing cubes I kind of like them I never understood like the deal or the purpose of them but I think it's to like help compress everything more would you stay till the morning light or would you follow me or would you let it be if I leave tonight, we could do this right. We'll find the remedy. Or would you stay with me now till the morning light? Before you turn away, I just want you to know that I didn't throw your stuff away. Before you make up your mind that I'm nowhere to find, I'm standing right here. in peter just left me to go to a work meeting he's gonna be in meetings all day and i thought i'd give you a little room tour don't mind me i just got off the plane i'm like completely gross and everything look how neutral and beautiful the room looks wow it looks really blue because of the filter but nice big king bed and this looks really nice well honestly like the decor in here is really nice oh, i wish you could see it it looks so blue in this how stunning can we have a moment for the beach i'm just gonna be living life for real though i'm gonna get food first so I'm going to get changed because I'm wearing a sweater and it's like 80 degrees. I'm going to really enjoy myself here because I've been like stressed and anxious a lot lately and it's really beautiful here and I'm going to try to soak it up.
about me Or would you let it be If I leave tonight We could do this right We'll find the remedy Or would you stay Okay, so we are in Miami. This room is definitely not the same as the last room that we had it's much smaller <laughs> literally no view but it doesn't matter because we're not really going to be in here we just took an uber here and i got some starbucks coffee across the street peter had a quick work meeting and now he is out and i am ready to hit the town so this is today's look i don't know if this is like miami -y enough but like i don't really care it's kind of hot out and I don't really know what I want to wear. I want something that's like comfortable or whatever. So I have this dress. It's kind of funny because like these buttons, I feel like are kind of similar to like these things on my bag. Have it with just like some sneakers and I'm gonna, my little Balenciaga bag. And I'm gonna just do a little shopping. Peter needs a belt, so I have to go find him a belt. Um, which is fine because I was planning on doing tons of shopping anyway today, so I am undecided where I want to go. I'm thinking The design district first and they have like all these different stores and everything if I don't and once I'm done there if I'm like uh, then I might go To North Beach and check out the mall there. I don't know why I like go to the beach and I go to the mall like I should go to the beach or the pool. I just don't really feel like it right now. Um, and Peter needs a belt. So that's my excuse for shopping. <laughs> but yeah, I do want to go to South Beach at some point. But I'm thinking that tomorrow morning, Peter and I will have more time together. He's like done with his meetings by then. So I'm thinking that me and him can go explore South Beach together at that time. Because I feel like he's not going to really want to go to like the design district but I'm gonna see if I can find him a nice little belt and then give it to him as a surprise if you will see another one of my vlogs I got him a present a luggage present but then he ended up getting a gift of luggage so then I ended up returning it so he's like what am I gonna have as a gift then so I think I'm gonna get him a, a nice belt as a gift instead of just getting him like a quick belt so let's see if we can find i saw one online i did like a quick search i saw one online that i liked but i just checked the store and i don't think they have it so i wanted to walk around the stores anyway so let's kind of see what we find so this is the design district so many things i'm it's really actually beautiful Outside for the pool and eat until Peter gets back. I get a high every time we kiss. Can't get enough, baby. So come give me love. All of your love. I can't fake it. When I'm with you, my legs go weak. Can you hear it? I think my heart just skipped a beat. Okay, so I opened the belt and he was very nervous. It was gonna be the double G. But obviously, I did not get that. Okay, so here's the belt. 
This man did a ruthless unboxing, so I'm actually kind of glad I didn't show it to you, but it came in this really cute box. They did such a nice job with a little ribbon outside of it, and then it was wrapped in this like Gucci newspaper thing, and this is the, the belt. He really wanted a brown belt, so I figured I'd get him a Gucci belt, and this is the style. Isn't this so nice? Very like subtle. So maybe he'll let me show the whole look later, but this looks really nice. I love it. Okay, now I'm going to show you what I got. I got this from Off-White. First of all, this bag is way too big. They did not need to give me this big of a bag. But it's really cute. It has like the off-white. I don't even think I can take this back to New York or New Jersey or wherever if I'm going. But it's really cute, right? With the holes of their like brand. Let's see what I got. Oh, the bag is so nice. I'm honestly so upset I'm not gonna take this back. I got a big tote bag. It has the like X off whites all over it. And then the little things here says so like off, but it's like all black. And I like love that. Love that for me. Inside there's a little zipper, a little pouch. And then a little leather thing here, but it's just like a giant tote. I've been eyeing this for a while. It has two options for handles. And I wanted this to be like my personal item for the plane. I've been eyeing it for a while, I've been wanting in that. And then I got so anxious trying to prepare for the flight that like trying to figure out like my personal item, how I'm gonna carry everything I need. I wish I had a giant tote bag and honestly, this is really big. So it's really good. I don't have pants on, so. I'm wearing a bathing suit. <laughs> this is the size, so as you can see, it's really big. And then I can put everything in here and I just love the color. I like love the way it looks. It's like so chic. You see it perfect over my shoulder okay so as i mentioned we're here for our wedding i believe i mentioned that so tonight is the welcome dinner and we're gonna get ready now peter is back we're gonna get ready head down there maybe i'll vlog a little bit of it so you can see i'll definitely vlog my look this is the look we did little braids in the front cute top skirt bag the aminas and just show the belt real quick looks good love it slit So extra, but I know I'm the same. Yeah. Love me in spite of my trauma. Give me what I need instead of the drama. Cause when it pop off, it's like, oh my, all good all day, but the night we be going so hard on the flip side. So tell me we'll be on a day, babe. I could keep that same energy. When you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high. be on that way trying to control our emotions if we on a rise out of passion we could share love in the ocean but if you want to go insane either way baby we could go all night we could do it all night we could go all night all night do we heal do we bleed to the beach leave, but we could go all night now all of my calls go to the 
hell I block you so I don't raise hell Should've talked through it in detail I separate ways ain't gon' end well No But when we get back it's like oh my All bad all day but the night I Get that good good till we act right So tell me where we on the day babe I could keep that same energy When you go low, I go low too But you'd rather stay high, I know you Can we stay high, babe? It's good, right? Sorry, I'd rather be on that wave Trying to control our emotions If we on a rise out of passion We could share love in the ocean But if you wanna go and say the way, baby, we can move on Could collect it, but you pushing on my nerves And knowing your intention, I'm under pressure Okay, I'm admitting that a couple things I said Got acidic in the tone and the presence I get careless Long as you know I come with imperfections When you look at me, you see the soul through my flesh You something special Know you looking bomb, the way you dress it Gone flex it, hold it still and let my mind digest You got the leverage, you got the upper handle on the situation You worthy of a million more of the storms that we weathered We fight retreating, then fuck, but you trying to kill the cycle When nobody's stressing that body like me, I know the way you like it I treat you like a queen, run the castle, you a treasure Feel like you setting fire to my, my desire for the pleasure emotions, if we on the rise out of passion Share love in the ocean. ocean. But if you wanna go and say the way, baby, we could go on. We could go on.